<clears throat> Tonight we are drinking Brewery de Hoon Cornet Oat um, Strong Blonde Ale from Belgium. I uh, love Belgian blondes. I don't mind oak in a beer either. 8.5%, don't mind that. Can't really complain. Um, it's been piercing with rain here all week, so I deserve a beer. Golden, it's like a slightly hazy golden colour. Uh, low white head, it was quite carbonated. I actually had to take a picture for Instagram first, so um, that's why it doesn't look so pretty. Ooh, on the nose, it smells really, really good, like very black, like light and bready. Like um, you've got some sort of citrus notes in there, a little bit of spice from the Belgian yeast. Just smells good, it smells lively. Um, I'm not getting much oak on the nose. Man, that's really carbonated. Mm. <coughs> There's the oak. Okay. Um, so nice bready malt up front. Really carbonated, like really, really fluffy in the mouth. Just explodes when it hits you in the mouth. Um, you got medium sweet malt up front, medium body, uh, nice dry finish. Um, you got some lovely fruity, fruity esters from the yeast, a little bit of spice. Uh, and then you got some oak, that slight timber hint in the background um, with a lot, mild oak astringency, but it's actually very, the oak's very, very complimentary. It's not dominant. It's, it's not taking things over. It's allowing the beer to sing, but sort of complimenting it. I just, I did just have a Dulce de Leche ice cream before I had this, so my mouth might be slightly out of whack, but I did have some water and rinse out. But it's actually really good. The oak's... The oak's in there just as a component. They're all, all the flavors are actually really well melded together. There's nothing out of place in here. The alcohol is very well hidden. This is actually a very, very nice beer. So, cheers.